Hey y'all. So I'm just getting off work. Uh, I am gonna go to the grocery store real quick. I think we're gonna have some tacos tonight. And then I gotta pick up Sydney from daycare. But I gotta go to the store before I go get her. Cause y'all going to the store with a toddler. Hot food mess, okay? Let me just tell you that. It's a hot food mess. Go that way. Oh. You know, they, depending on the mood, they hungry or they gotta use the bathroom or all of the above. I'm tired, I'm bored. And I just need to get in and out of the store. I don't have time for the extra stuff. Okay? So, y'all can come along with me to the next door. Uh, it's Taco Tuesday, so I'm gonna do some tacos. I'll probably get like the impossible meat because uh, my husband don't eat beef, but I like beef. I don't like turkey. He like that ground turkey mess. I I just if I don't have to eat that, I'm not eating that. <laughs> so I probably I rather eat the impossible meat than turkey meat. Is that bad? Like turkey just has a really disgusting taste to me. It's like a nasty aftertaste that I just can't get with. So I'm at Schnucks. I'm about to go in and buy these few items. The sun is real disrespectful right now. So I will holla at y'all a little bit later. So this is what we got from the store. Uh, I got some sour cream, some shredded lettuce. Excuse the lighting, I didn't hook up my uh, ring light because I'm lazy. And I'm just trying to show y'all this before I cook it. So some shredded cheese, I got some tortillas, some cheese sauce, because I think I'm gonna make a, um, Crunchwrap Supreme, check out my YouTube channel. Um, I have a video already on there for it. Yes, baby. I got some pepperoni, not going with the tacos, but we'll probably make pizza sometime this week. So, got some pepperoni, got some uh, tomatoes, some peaches. They gotta get ripe though, cause they still kinda hard, but I wanna make some peach ham pies. And then we got some salsa. I got some diced tomato to go with this uh, jambalaya on a day when, you know, just need to make something quick. I have some chicken and dewy sausage that I can put in there. And then I got some of these little uh, pasta ronis for Sydney. Another quick dinner, cause y'all, you know, sometimes it be a struggle. Got some on the border tortilla chips. Got some um, tortas, not tortas, tostadas. Uh, for my crunch wrap, obviously I'm sound like I want a torta, a torta. Um, and then this is the Guardian brand beef, beef is brown. And so I'm using this for the tacos instead of like the impossible beef, but it's plant-based. And that was it. That's all I got from the store. It don't look like I bought much of nothing. I bet you I spent like how much did I spend? I spent $61, <laughs> and this is what $61 will get you at Schnucks. So again, about to make um, some dinner. I'm gonna make um, some tacos with this Guardian beef was ground, plant-based, because again, I don't like uh, ground turkey, so 
that's what I'm about to do. And yeah. All right. Again, so here I am. I put a little bit of avocado oil up in there. And then. Uh oh. Thank you for turning it off. And then I'm just putting that in there. Let it defrost. You might have to put a little bit of water up in there because <laughs> it's clumped together, um, which probably isn't good. But I'll be back. So I just added some water to this um, to help it cook. But obviously, you cook it to, you know, you want it to be a little crunchy. Not crunchy, but <laughs> crispy. So it won't be like mushy. Uh, but y'all know this is not meat, it's plant based. So, need a little something extra. I'm not adding any other seasonings to this because this. Uh, this particular brand i feel like it can be a little on the um it has a little spice to it like the kids always claim it's spicy so it might have a little bit of pepper in it or something so i don't add none extra to it i'm just going to add the taco seasoning and that's gonna be dinner We, we started batting it like this instead of batting all the little packs because it just seems easier. Although I think the packs have more flavor for whatever reason. So. And you want to obviously season to your taste. Just make sure your food is not bad because we don't want no bland food. Season as you go. Probably add some more after I taste it. But this is super simple, y'all. Y'all just kind of look like the Taco Bell meat. <laughs> what they be putting? This? They probably giving y'all some plant-based protein over there at Taco Bell while y'all playing. Hmm. Don't nobody really. We work at Taco Bell. What, what is it? What kind of meat is that? They giving us these? Well, I don't really eat Taco Bell, so I don't know. But it kind of looks the same. If you ask me suspect so i'm just gonna cook this until it crisps up a little bit so i definitely thought we had <laughs> some like burrito size uh tortillas but we didn't we only had like a regular size so it's not cute y'all <laughs> hopefully it tastes good check out my video for crunch wrap supreme i will link it in the description box below they are delicious, way better than Taco Bell. I even got some hot uh, Taco Bell sauce. I found it. So you just wanna brown it on both sides until you get crispy. I put a little bit of oil in the pan and that's that. So I'm just gonna keep browning it. Yep, flip it. Bam. Let me get this up out of here before my smoke alarm start going. Happy on. Labor Day, y'all. So I'm about to go into Sam's Club because, you know, we wait till the very end of the weekend to go grocery shopping for the house. Like, what is that about? And so this is probably the first Labor Day that we haven't, like, cooked anything or hosted people. And honestly, I'm okay with that because, believe it or not, I get tired of cooking excuse my hair i washed it and i just haven't curled it and flat earned it and all that good stuff yet so it's dry i got gray hair <laughs> what is life and so i'm about to go into sam's club and hopefully this time i will remember to actually show you all the food when i get home bye
got out of Sam's. Spent way too much money. Um, my husband usually does the grocery shopping. I'm like, what do you be buying? It costs so much. I used to shop for myself all the time when I lived by myself. But child, these prices is ridiculous. Like, why did I spend so much money at Sam's? I was like, too much money to be spending on like laundry detergent and a few grocery items like i hate going to sam's i swear i do all right y'all so i'm back home from sam's and walmart went to walmart against my better judgment so i'm just showing y'all what i got so we got three cartons of oat milk because you know got allergies so move that up out the way and try not to break nothing and then we got some romaine lettuce for some salad, I gotta make some salad. Um, got this fruit pack for my children. These Velveeta snack packs that obviously didn't <laughs> barely made it in the house. Oh, I had put on some press on nails, and it's already been in up. Anyway, got some blueberries and some green grapes. Y'all, I spent too much money at Sam's. We got some English cucumbers to put in the salad. Um, we like to eat this Mediterranean pasta salad from Sam's. It's really good, y'all. I got like kale, um, some type of spiral pasta, sun-dried tomatoes, Parmesan, and like some type of dressing. It's really good. I got, so this is part of the Sam's haul. I'm gonna be putting stuff away as I kind of go. Through. So I got some Prego. It's a three pack of Prego from Le Sam's. Got some on the vine tomatoes, some gala apples, some orange juice, some eggs. Got some oven roasted turkey breast. And got some Eckerd sausage. These are, I love Eckerd sausage. That's pretty much all I ate when I was pregnant. But anyway, all right. And then so I got some chicken thighs, some chicken breasts. I need to separate this stuff. I got some party wings because those are good in like the air fryer. You can flavor them up. Some ready to eat bacon and some some beef uh, burgers for some Salisbury steaks. So this is the stuff I got from Walmart. I'm gonna make it quick. Got some turkey extra sausage, some diced tomato. Got some smoked turkey wings that I'll probably put in some beans. I wanted to find some cabbage, but I didn't see none at the store. Got some frozen broccoli, green beans. Got some mixed vegetables, some peas, some corn. Um, got some yellow potatoes. Needed some more cooking spray. Got some taco sauce because we didn't have none when I was eating my tacos earlier this week. Got some bell peppers, some strawberries, and got some Crisco because I didn't have any when I was making some dough. And then I got a couple boxes of protein noodles for some pasta. Uh, what else we got over here? I got some Hidden Valley Ranch, the only ranch you need to be buying. And then I got some... I got a, a new thermos and some applesauce because the children love applesauce. And so, Not from Walmart, but I got it from Sam's. I just forgot to show you. And then I got some laundry sanitizer, some uh, laundry detergent, and then we needed some dishwasher stuff. And then I got some paper towels and some tissue in the car. Well, no, it's in the garage, and I'm not about to go get that. So oh, hey y'all, it's the end of the vlog. I really need to stop ending the vlog like this. Um, my hair is getting so long. I ain't need a haircut really bad. Um, but anyway, I took you guys shopping with me. We did a little bit of cooking of some basic food. And so the biggest grocery haul we did was at Sam's and Walmart, um, which happened yesterday on Labor Day. Um, Cause this is probably, like I said earlier, one of the first years we didn't cook or host people. And I'm totally okay with that because I get tired of cooking sometimes. Um, but 
I hope you guys enjoy this video. I hope to have some food videos out pretty soon. Um, I have a few that should be ready to go. And um, if you have some ideas for things you want me to cook on the channel or topics you want me to cover or what y'all want this to look like, I am more than um, happy to take suggestions on what you guys want to see. I really do appreciate all of the support. And if you're new to my channel, welcome. And please make sure you like, share, comment, and subscribe. I truly appreciate the support. See you guys next time. Bye.